Welcome to Living Off The Van. We're the Nolders, Henry and Sarah, along with our three kids, Nyoka, Kiana and Louie. We've packed up our everyday lives to travel Australia with no known end date. Watch and subscribe to Living Off The Van to follow our adventures and see all the amazing places we go. So last night we camped uh, next to the Gibb River, cool camp, nice and sandy, um, beautiful water. So we all had a bit of a dip, uh, met some people there. We all sat around a fire and watched footy and had a few drinks. Um, we just come for a walk this morning across the road or about three or four hundred meters from the Gibb uh, River. There's a bit of an Aboriginal rock art site so we just come for a walk this morning before we head off and head to Mount Barnett or Manning Gorge thought we'll come for a walk and have a look while it's nice and cool and we found yeah some really cool rock art so we'll pop that in and give you a look um, it, it looks fairly recent very very um, clear so we're not sure how old it is there's no signs or anything saying how old it is but it definitely looks fairly recent um but yeah little hidden gem here we've um found quite a lot or looked at quite a lot of rock art here up in the kimberleys so we're um we're definitely loving it
we're at Manning Gorge campground here. You just check in at the roadhouse, Mount Barnett Roadhouse, and pay your camping fees. How much was it, Henry? 40 bucks a night. It Ooh, was. 40 bucks a night. Yeah, Sheesh. that's what I thought. Right. It's, it's a bit of a steamy hot place here. Yeah, well, we paid 40 bucks a night at King Edward as well. And, um,. Yeah, we thought that was a bit uh, rich, considering they didn't even have showers or anything there. And I don't know, I think they have a shower block here and stuff, and laundry, but yeah, um, <sighs> pretty steep. It's but so hot. We're just literally camped near the uh, swimming spot, the waterhole, where you cross to go over on the hike. So we're going to have a swim. All the adults are going to come down for a swim while the kids are all swam out they were in the water all day today louis having a nap uh, so we're gonna have a few drinks in the swim i'm getting in the water yeah <laughs> Oh, it's good though. Why did the fish start attacking you? No. It's pretty clear. There's a lot of paper on here. Is that where the rope swing is? Okay. Yeah. That's not a lot of rope. Alright, still going. Well, I'm gonna go for a swim. Look at the water. Oh, I tried to get under the rope. My hair got caught. Maybe. Can you like stand still for like a couple of minutes? <laughs> We're hiking to Manning Gorge this morning. Uh, it's quarter past six. We thought we'd beat the heat, see how we go. But we will show you what's involved in this hike. Hey, Oak. Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, there's our caravan and car. And we've just got to walk down here to the water and then we start the hike to the gorge. Damn it, people bet us to the boat. I don't know. Maybe they don't know that there's a rope. Did the rope break? <gasps> it could have. See, like all the barrels are over the other side. Ah. How are you going to get back? back? See, and all the barrels are over there. Yeah, which is all right. Mm. Well, well, let's um, let's get our rowboat by looking at it back over here, and we'll we'll get going. 
I've already seen a heap of yeah. people head over, so. What do you mean? Well, not the first one. I even just saw that person go over. No, but see how the blue tubs are over there? So people are hiking. <coughs> people probably swam across. Oh. Are they going to fix the road? No, nah, they'll just jump out and then you tie it back. Pull it back. Pull it back again. Exactly oh. like that. Lay it on the ground so that it unrolls like that. Really? You can't do it yourself? You still got to get mum to feed you. It's a crow. Right, well, let's get into it. Pull the boat. See? Give it to the crow. Come on. I've got Louie, I can't do it. Give it to it. the crow. Let me pull the boat. Give it to oh, the crow. dirty. <clears throat> it won't be for the first. The rope's dirty. Now it's wet. Look, they still have this little mess. Mum pulling the face. Ah. Yeah. Thanks. Oh, Lord. We're breaking the rope. No, I don't know if it was done. It was already like that. It's going to go all over the place. <laughs> Louie's laughing. He thinks it's funny. Mum was doing her hair. She thought that was funny. When mum drives, she thinks that's oh, funny. Bro. <coughs> I don't even know what the time is, do you? Quarter past six. Go, okay, grab it, click, go there, it's fine. I have no hand, <laughs> boy. Quick, it's gonna I'm just going to sit here and enjoy the view. Hey, Louie. Huh? Oh, nothing. What are you I'm just enjoying doing f all for once. Here's a bit of a tip. Carry your kid if you don't want to feel the rowing. Fasten oh, the GoPro. What are you doing? Better hold on to the GoPro. And then if you get up here, you go out the same time. And that's how you use a GoPro to help you get out of the water. God, that was an effort. Oh, because someone... No. That's why it broke. Yeah. Oh, because everyone was tying knots and stuff in it yesterday. And I was like, this... It's not going to work. Anyway. I think I might just go back. Let's go. Rowing was not on my agenda this morning. Wait. My legs are sore. <laughs> legs are sore. You do not. Yeah, you just stood there. Do you know how hard it is to stand there and try and not fall over yeah. from you guys? Yeah, that way. Yeah. Let's go. How's your toasty, mate?
He's like smiling and sucking. Well, we have arrived at Manning Gorge. What do you think of that waterfall, Libby? What do you think? Watch me, caught up in the light, I'm falling. Tripping to the night, I'm all in. Drifting in your tide, we're falling. This feeling is left like a river running to you And make me go Someone's fixed the rope since we uh, did our walk. So this is the end of the walk. Dad, we're going to get in the water, but CBF getting my shoes off and carrying them. We'll yeah. just go get them, drop them off at the van and come back. Go grab a coffee. Sit at the water. It's only quarter to nine, so that took us an hour. One hour to get back. People always say that walks take like four hours. We finish it in like two. Mm. Now here I am Doing all the work just packing up now we've I don't know if we showed you where we camped here shut your door down private property at the moment and we're gonna go for a little drive up the road and Henry's gonna sit in the van um, and he's gonna see what the van is like when we're driving I think I'll probably drive I don't know five k's or something and just um, he'll see what it's like and give you a look at what happens in the van when we're traveling Right, so we're just leaving uh, Matting Gorge. Now I'm just sitting inside the van while Sarah drives up the private road, driveway. Um, doing this because I want to know what it is, what it's like to be inside the van while it's driving down the road. So here we go. 
just want to know what the noises are like and what's rattling and if there's anything that needs to be fixed or whatever then I'll now know Turn the caravan on so you probably won't hear me, but see how this goes. I might just turn the caravan off real quick. the oven tray rattling. It's not too bad really, I thought it would be a hell of a lot worse. But we haven't hit any corrugated roads, oh here we go. Wow. It's amazing that this holds up better as it does. I'm just going to sit here. Stuff on Louis bum. Oh my It's a bit like being in the back of the Ute while you're driving, going out shooting with your friends and family. Not too bad. It's just the ovens that are making all the noise. Anyway, I'm going to turn this off and... Most of the time they've been here. It's fine. We've just left uh, the Manning Gorge campground. Went and topped up water and stuff at Mount Barnett. And then we have just come to Galvin's Gorge. So, quick little 1k walk. To a swimming hole we'll show you what that's like and then plan is we're just gonna duck in here have a swim and then we're gonna all uh, meet back up with our friends at silent grove campground later today
sit in his phone all night. Not that far to walk. Louis! <laughs> Trying to enjoy a peaceful swim. And then Louis just crying for me. That was the perfect swimming spot if you're passing Galvin's Gorge, duck in for a nice swim to cool off and then just keep heading whatever direction you're heading but so glad we stopped there and had a swim. We're gonna have some lunch now in the van and then head to the campground.